Demand for Earth resources is presently stronger than any time before in history. The time to address sustainability is now. We have no complete, consensual and user-friendly accurate method to evaluate sustainability. Sustainability is composed by multiple interconnected parameters, but no current evaluation method correlate them. Sustainability has no universal unit of measurement. We are a multidisciplinary team of 25 people combining expertise in areas as diverse as biology, biodiversity, hydraulics, energy, engineering, physics, geography, climate research, mathematics, landscape architecture, history, cultural heritage and education. We came from different institutes, faculties, research centers and one museum from the University of Lisbon, Portugal. We have been based at the National Museum of Natural History and Science where we have been working on the sustainability of its botanical garden. In this project, we have faced firsthand the challenges and difficulties of accurately assessing sustainability. That's why we have been developing a method that has universal application. The sustainability assessment tool is a simple but effective method that can be used both to evaluate natural and urban systems or as a return investment tool. This tool is based on two different evaluations ecological and social. Ecological evaluations includes the full accountability of all natural resources and uses the dust-to-dust -dust full life cycle assessment method. The evaluate parameters are water, energy, air, matter and biodiversity. The social evaluation is paramount for us. STU calculates the ecological component and counterbalances its value with a social assessment value, made as a contingent valuation. The second component evaluates all the social benefits of a certain system to society and its impact on human lives. The second component evaluates all the social benefits of a certain system to society and its impact on human lives. Why is this tool innovative? This tool converts different sustainability parameters into a single unit of measurement, accounts for and encourages positive environmental practices, it has simple application, it allows combined projects for mutual compensation of environmental damages, it can be used as an accreditation system, it provides continuous monitoring of sustainability even after completion. This complete and unified approach has never been attempted before.